So teacher development in South Africa is critical because it influences the whole system. If we focus on learners, we, we, we kind of fix a, a cohort of learners and we help them along. But a teacher, of course, has this impact on multiple cohorts of learners. So teacher education is key. And, and a couple of areas there, initial teacher education, I'd, th I'd say, is even more important. So a lot of the work Jet is doing at the moment is with universities and looking at the curriculum. How do we train teachers? How do we make sure teachers are prepared when they, when they hit the schools to be able to be good teachers and to be ready for that? So I think it's absolutely critical. Second area we're looking at is, is induction and how teachers, once they qualify, and how they go into schools and how we assist them. A teacher that's just finished a four-year B.Ed. is often not prepared to hit a rural school or, or to reach a rural, maybe hit is the wrong word, to, to reach a rural school. And they're just not ready for it. So how do we go through an induction process? So we're working with the DBE at the moment to assist them with an induction process that will be used across all provinces. Some provinces at the moment do have induction, but it's kind of varied across the provinces. Third area is around teacher internships. The teacher internship model, I think, has got a lot of potential for us as a country. We had a lunchtime session today. We're together with Trilog and GTI and the Bertha Institute. We're looking at supporting teacher internships in a more collaborative, coherent way, to look at good practices and to try and see how teacher internship models can be used more effectively. A teacher that is in the schools while they're being trained, we find is much better at teaching at the end of the day than a graduate that comes out of university and faces this school environment, as I mentioned just now. So teacher education is key, and it's an area that JET works in extensively with many partners.